All right, everybody, welcome to the start of something new, but also maybe a bit familiar. Obviously, we've done our fair share of Skyblocks, but a few years back, I did a little mini series called Minecraft, but it's one block. Now that was done with a data pack, so it was vanilla, but this takes that concept and, and cranks it up to 11 with a whole mod pack built around this one block. Make sure to like the video for the start of a new series and help us reach our incredibly ambitious goal of one like for, for one block and also subscribe. So this is the all-in-one mod pack. And I know what you're gonna say, Jardon, you've lied. This is not one block. This is a three by three. There are blocks below it. What gives? I can't believe this. Okay, so first off, these blocks around the one block, they're, they're not actually dirt blocks. They're not functional. They're used to indicate the level of the one block. And we have this one block analyzer that we're given here. And if I right click on the one block, it'll tell us that we're on the flatland stage and we've mined two blocks blocks so far and as we go and we keep mining it'll keep updating and eventually I don't know how many blocks we actually have to mine that'll be a surprise will rank up to the next level and I don't know if it's how many blocks or if we have to accomplish specific goals but there is a whole quest log to go with it so let's start if you're playing multiplayer you can create a party I'm not, but you can if you go to mcprohosting.com slash Captain Sparkles and use code Captain Sparkles for 25% off and you can play the all-in-one mod pack with your friends. Link in the description. Okay, so also, I guess if we go into different dimensions, uh, we have like a time limit, which is kind of wild. We're gonna have to speed run getting ores and stuff like that. We did it, we're getting started and now we have like a bunch more sections. Um, that is a lot of ores that we have to mine and we can get a terra shatter if we mine every single ore we get a terra shatter fantastic so okay we're in flatland so first off we need 128 dirt then we'll get a grass block which probably good for farmland and sort not farmland but for sheep probably so we can regrow wool if we breed animals we get spawn eggs if we get sand we get sand if we get clay we get clay so i feel like we could start by like mining this okay so we're getting some leaves we're getting grass clay. I suppose we probably have to get really lucky with the leaves in order to ensure that we get saplings. Fingers crossed. Like, I don't know of any way to increase the odds of getting saplings. I think dirt chest 9,000. It's over 9,000, but it's not. It's actually 64 dirt, but that gets us like way closer to our, our goal of 128. That makes things a lot quicker. Like, do I actually like, do I keep the chest if I punch it? Do I? I do. Wow, the dirt chest 9,000, so cool. Can I store only, only dirt, only dirt <laughs> can be stored in the dirt chest 9,000. How very cool. Also, okay, so Astral Tome, familiar, Astral Sorcery. Shout out to Heckfire, for those of you who, you know, follow Vault Hunters or anything like that, materials and you, we know that. Blueprint package contains some blueprints for gear crafting. So I know this is a mod that I've never experienced, but it's kind of like Tinker's Constructy, I think. And so we get these blueprints and I guess we can use them to make tools, but in our two by two without actually needing a crafting table or something. But I feel like we need wood probably in order to do it. So we need a crafting table anyway at that point. I don't know, I'm sure it's gonna be useful for some some things I just don't know too much about it and so we're gonna have to learn quest book we already have quick access to and then our analyzer so we know we've mined 21 blocks so far wait maybe before I get too far should I like should I get rid of some of this stuff down here I actually want living root oh it's botania stuff huh let me maybe do I want to hopefully I can get this I should be able to get this with my fist right so what does this give us living root and, oh, we can make saplings or we can make floral fertilizer from it. Okay, those are good. So we should actually probably collect this stuff. And then I wonder what biome we're in. We're in a birch forest. Okay, so we don't have to worry about water freezing. That's always very nice. And how should we go? I'm gonna end up just making this water kind of go all over the place. But yeah, we definitely don't want to lose the water, I don't think. Since we have quark though, I think I can, yeah, I can place underneath. We can do that and then I can, so I can just try to like collect all this stuff maybe. And then, I mean, we're, dirt's pretty renewable. I think, I can, uh, then I can just break blocks behind us and, and continue the process over here until I hopefully don't, okay, we're falling. 
Everything's great. Everything's fine. There is absolutely nothing to worry about. <laughs> so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna clean things up a little bit here, uh, and then we will continue mining the one block. All right, we've tidied things up. We don't have a wonky water flow going all the way down. I lost a few good dirt blocks in the process, but I'm sure we'll get some more here. And I don't think I let any of the living root drop down. So we're good there. We'll be able to make some saplings and the water is just saved under there for future use whenever we get a bucket or something like that. Look, a beehive, poor bees. Give me, oh, let's freaking go, dude. 128 dirt, huge place. So now we can get, oh, that unlocked a whole bunch of stuff. Grass block, which we're gonna wanna be strategic about placing probably, and 32 more dirt. Bro, wait, I have so much dirt. I can just expand the heck out of this platform now if I want to, and store dirt in, in here as well. Wow, <laughs> it's, a, it's kind of a big deal. Where should we expand out? I feel like we should kinda, I don't know, keep the one block area pretty, pretty prominent so that we know where it is. Eventually we'll make, I don't know, like a, a monument to the one block. I just wanna have easy access to the water in case we need it later, because we can't we can't break these. So the only way to grab it's from the side. Anyway, that allows us to kind of keep track of where that is and we'll make a little platform. We don't wanna to go too far though, because obviously in that case, we might have to worry about mob spawning far away without having torches. So we'll be a little bit careful. But I think, I think we can have some mobs uh, spawning from here. So uh, I want to figure out like how to you know, make a pen or something. I guess I could make like a pen out of dirt. I don't know. I really need wood. Oh, hey buddy. Wait, I just got a chicken and a sheep at the same time. Uh, don't walk off the edge. You guys wouldn't do that, right? You guys wouldn't walk off the edge. That'd be so dumb. And you guys are smart, right? Pigs are super smart. I don't know so much about chickens, but pigs, man, you guys. Huge, gigantic brains. I just know it. So how many blocks have we mined so far? 41. Doing doing great. So what were the challenges? We need to get... Okay, so we need to get each of these kinds of saplings, which I assume means getting incredibly lucky from mining the leaves. Oh God, that could take ages. We got red sand. Clay, we just need a little more clay. And this one is for breeding, which how are we gonna breed before we've farmed? We need a whole farm before we can even do that. So oh, for one of these times, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be mining and then it's gonna spawn right in front of me. I'm gonna punch it and it's gonna run off the edge and I am gonna be very, very sad. Okay, please move. Move away from the one block. It's very important that you back up a little bit. I don't want to punch you. I want you to be safe. Oh wait, oh wait, no, no, I just need to craft a clay block. Oh, that unlocked more stuff. Let's go 32 clay balls and we get a botany pot. Okay, wait, that's kind of huge and I can do that right now. And then we can get a botany pot. Oh, let's go. Okay, so a botany pot, if I make a sapling, can we then put that into there? I don't know if I can break this with my hands. So you can do you can do a hopping one, right? But this I don't think this is a hopping one. So that means I don't need to put this one on a, a chest. I don't think. Do I have to put dirt in it? Yes. And then sapling. And then yo, let's go! It's growing. Grow time two minutes and ten seconds. Wait, this is huge. Look, you guys, this is awesome. I hope that I didn't place this down prematurely before I like get a tool or something like that. Is there a way? I don't know if there's a way for me to like use this and dirt to make a tool. I feel like I need wood and this is gonna be, get, this is gonna give me wood, right? Like it's gotta give me wood. It's gonna grow a tree in the, hello. Gonna need to move out of the way so I can keep punching. This is gonna get really crowded really, really quickly, isn't it? I'm gonna need to expand this even further and then figure out also like where to, frick, it's gonna keep happening. Cork can be both a blessing and a curse for its like ability to do bedrock block placing and stuff like that. I'm gonna, I'll make it a little bit bigger. Eventually we'll like expand it around and stuff like that. Um, for now, I just, I don't know. I'm just building it in this direction, but yeah, we're gonna, I'm checking the chest as if there's gonna be anything in there other than freaking dirt. I just have to keep mining basically, wait for the tree to grow and then get really lucky in case eventually I punch a leaf and I and I get a sapling. So, oh, kelp, wait, food. Yo, we got a food source guys. This is like, this is huge maneuvers for us. Uh, I have to wait, I have to make the hopper. Wait, how am I gonna make the hopping bonsai? I have no iron. How do you expect me to accomplish this?
Oh, I'm gonna get these if I get 10 sand. Okay, that's actually, I could use those blocks to kind of like mark off where the one block is, give a little, little boundary around it or something. I just wanna mark it off, make a shrine out of it or something. Oh, we got two pigs now. Okay, this is great. So eventually when we get carrots, we'll be able to get more pigs. Remind me everybody. So I don't do a big, huge dumb. Is that 10 sand right there? I gotta be close, right? Nine out of 10. Remind me when I get a potato or a carrot, not to just either eat it or feed it, and to instead, um, you know, plant it first so that I don't do a big dumb thing. Okay, so sandy bricks, are those good for anything? We can make, yeah, we can't, we can't make tools. I mean, shouldn't really be surprised, but okay. I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do a little, I'm gonna mark off, this is going to be the tier one, one block shrine, please move out of the way so that I do not spleef you guys. This is important construction work, okay? Move? You guys, I swear, dude, I swear. Why do you have, why, I, I get it. You wanna be close to the action, but just please, please be careful. Please be careful. I don't wanna lose you. I've become too attached already. There we go, dude, this is sick. Sapling, no saplings, god dang it, dude. Actually, wait, okay, it says, Oak sapling, progress 100%. Uh, do I like, wait, do I click it or something? Oh, well, that's cool, I can move it. Uh, what, this is the worst, this is the worst block I've ever dealt with. I got nothing, I got nothing. What did I do wrong? Wait, why did it do that? This thing sucks. What the heck, maybe you need the hopping one? Okay, I don't, okay, cool, thanks for that. Oh, I got sticks. I still don't think I can do anything with them. <laughs> I, have, I have no wood. Hey, you, over here. You're gonna give us wood? You're just gonna be worthless. Wait, oh, I got a sapling. I got a dark oak. I don't actually know if that's that. I don't think that was part of the challenge. No, it wasn't, but still good to have another sapling. Okay, what am I doing wrong? And why are you dumb? Did you give me wood? You, oh, oh, you did. Let's go. Okay, it must be a percent chance. A percent chance to get one oak log. That's all I get. Wait a minute, but, oh, you know what? Maybe this is like the opportunity here that I needed. Not that I actually need a pickaxe yet, but I think with these, you can make a tool, but in the two by two grid. I guess I don't necessarily need it yet. So maybe I'll hold on to the log for now and just keep on mining. So far, we, okay, we've mined 172 blocks. I'm very curious, like, what the criteria is for it leveling up a new stage. Maybe it's like once we make a pickaxe or something, because I bet the next stage is the underground. I would imagine we have to, maybe it unlocks when we make the wooden pickaxe. And I don't know if we wanna, if that's the case, maybe we wanna hold off for a little bit because if it stays in this tier, then we can potentially keep getting more and more animals. Unless maybe we've like hit our cap. I don't know if it's like you kind of get a certain allotment. Uh, oh, wait, I got an actual, oh, let's freaking go, dude. Wait, this is a huge pickup. This is a huge pickup. Wait, I don't actually have to worry about the, the water at all down there. You've misled me. This water, this water doesn't matter. All right, well, I guess that's something then. And then I can just, oh, we ranked up, dude. We've ranked up. All right, so we've got our first actual chest. We've got oak logs. And now if we do the one block analyzer, we're at farmland. So it was at 200 blocks mine. You get to the farmland tier. Oh, that's cool, dude. Wait, okay, so now we're getting pumpkins. And I wonder if we're gonna start getting any blocks that can't be mined with a, a fist. I, a bag of rice. Can I, can I do this with a fist? I can, I can. Oh, we're getting food now? We're getting, okay. Wait, this is, this is cool. See, this is what I was talking about though. Like these blocks, they're not like actually, they're not block blocks. They are indicators for the one block. I didn't mislead you. It's still all centered. No, nope. don't walk in front of my fist. You're gonna get punched. They're, they're indicators for the one block. I'm starting to think maybe an ax would be a good first tool to make because a lot of these are ax breakable blocks, trees as well. Are we gonna get, hey, we got another wood, let's go. We must've just gotten like really unlucky the first time or something like that. Dude, I love the fact though that I can, I can put all this stuff in here, right? And then I can just move the chests by doing the, do the whole pickup strat on them. 
if I want. And that way I could, I don't know if it's worth expanding the platform at this point. I can't make a furnace yet, so I can't do torches. Um, and I think maybe this is what's giving us light at the moment. So, you know, with that said, now that I know I'm not gonna need to, to get the water, I'd say let's kind of, um, let's, let's encircle or in square the the one block area so that we get a little bit more area and then we can start kind of dividing stuff off and maybe find a place to i don't know put some put some of these animals that are just in the way it doesn't look like we're getting any more of them i'd like to say i planned it perfectly but we just so happen to have like the exact amount of dirt in order to complete an even platform centered around the one block. Okay, I think the next thing I should do probably is maybe make like a pen to breed the animals so that we can do the next challenge, which fortunately it's not specific. Like you just have to breed six animals because I was like, wait a minute, dude, we only have one cow. How am I going to breed a cow? But like, we'll get the spawn eggs just from breeding uh, six. So fortunately, like we, we do have a pair of sheep and a pair of pigs and a pair of chickens. We just didn't get so lucky on the cows, but that should be fine. And then we don't have to worry about them wandering around all over the place. Um, let me let me see. It showed that I could make walls from these bricks. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough to like do a full pen though, since I used those. Let me see. Oh, I need a crafting table. Let's make a crafting table. We've got plenty of oak logs at this point. All right, this is a big deal, folks. We got ourselves a crafting table. Let's go. Now, how many will we get? Get out of this. Yeah, it's not gonna be very many. What? Are, what's my best bet for like a a pen? It'd be good if I get some just actual fences, but you know, we're not we're not at that level. Yeah, hey, hey, more wood. You suck so much. Why are you like this? Since our bonsai thing kind of sucks, why don't we just plant saplings? That seems like a good idea. Also, I should make an infinite water source and we can do that. I don't know if there's gonna be enough light for the trees to grow here. I'll put them kind of around here so that hopefully the light source is enough. And then, I don't know, maybe actually I can use the, is the compost. Do I turn that into bone meal? Oh, I wonder if this is like a better, a better base for like the bonsai plant or some, okay, well, that's not done anything. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna look up if this is actually used for anything. But uh, what does it do? Does it speed up and it, no, I've got, I've got no idea. Thanks for the egg, buddy. I guess I, you know, I just punch blocks and then wait for saplings to grow. Probably plant more trees as well. Got what's gonna happen, dude, is it's gonna grow while the chicken is standing in it. It's gonna kill the chicken. The chicken is, is going to suffocate and it's gonna be so dumb. <laughs> I just know it's gonna happen. We're getting food though, so stop. You're gonna get punched. I'm eventually gonna have enough wood to be able to just make some fence pens. That's what we're going for here. Ooh! Oh, we've just gone to underground and our tree grew. Let's go. Okay, uh, well, I guess that means I have to make a pickaxe now and just a, just a stone pickaxe, but we can't actually mine the stone. Okay, you forced my hand, touche. Game, axe, and pickaxe it is. Even if we might not have to, I kind of want to try using the blueprints to make a tool just because, I don't know, it's new, it's interesting. I haven't I haven't used the mod before, so we might as well try to learn it. I have to imagine there's going to be a reason for having it. They wouldn't just give us these blueprints to start with if it was going to be... Oh, we get quick decomposition, let's go! Okay, wait, this is actually very, very nice. And now, even sampling distribution. Let's go. Hey, are you ready to go? We got another piece of wood, it almost flew off the island, but <laughs> there we have have it. All right. So, uh, do I want to, I guess the question is, do I want to convert all of it into this stuff? And okay, let me see if I can figure this out. So if I want to make an ax from this, what do I need to do? Material any. So blueprint, it looks like I need like a stick or just three pieces of wood. So if I, let's say I put the ax blueprint here and I do three pieces of wood. Okay. It gives me an oak wood axe head synergy 100 percent. oh and it has like attributes and stuff so i guess maybe that's why you would want to do it and then it kind of showed i think below it it looked like i needed to add a stick wait if i do this 
Okay, and then I add either a compound tool rod or can I just, is it like Tinker's? Can I just like do a, oh, I can do a stick. Oh, okay. Takes damage when on fire and can be used as fuel. Gear occasionally takes less damage, increases attack damage or decreased range damage. Huh. I wonder if the durability is any better or worse than like a, a standard wooden axe. Okay, let's try the same for a pickaxe. So like if I were to do this, I get a pickaxe head. So this is kind of cool, right? It allows you to make this. I could do it just in my two by two here. So then if I combine that with a stick, is it shapeless is what it is, it's shapeless. Now I have an oak wood pickaxe. Huh, okay. And now, does this work? Yo, let's go, wait, uh, uh oh. I can't mine this. Like, I don't actually think there's any way that I can mine this right now. Like, I need I need stone. I'm gonna have to just sacrifice some iron, I guess, until we get some stone so that we can mine it. Cause like, I don't, there we go. Okay, now we got stone, perfect. Chaos ore, what the frick, chaos ore? Uh, can't mine any of this, please. Oh, I can mine that. Oh, let's go, let's go. <gasps> what the frick, what the frick, what the frick? Thank goodness I made the X. What the heck? I wasn't ready. Bruh, this sucks. Give me like, oh, it's giving me create stuff as well. But I, 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 how am I, how do you expect me to mine any of this? This is very problematic. I've only got, you know, so much, so many blocks that I can mine in each tier, right? 310 blocks mined. It's like, I, I assume by 400, we're done with the underground tier. And then at that point, I'm, I'm out of luck. I need stone. I actually should check the quest here because, it's the I bet it's the quest. I bet it's the quest. The quest wants me to just make a standard wooden pickaxe, so I guess I should do that, um, because that might unlock us getting, I, I might be wasting things here. Okay, so we got a wooden pickaxe, and let me, so from there, it okay, we need stone. What do you, who, how am I supposed to get this if you're not giving me the stone pickaxe? I believe that the way that this works is because I tested out in another world and the, the starting block was always different. So I believe it just pulls from a pool of possible blocks, but it doesn't go in a particular order of progress. You're kidding. You're kidding me with this. You cannot, you cannot be serious. You cannot be serious right now. You're gonna, you're gonna force me to mine a diamond. I think I will get a diamond, right? Cause it'll still count as me breaking it. Just give me a diamond ore. Oh, you little, you little. Oh, get off the diamond. I'm about to do the most painful thing that I've ever done in the history of Minecraft. Ugh. I feel, I feel pain. I feel excruciating pain right now. No! Bro, what? I was not ready. I was not ready for that. I was not ready. Do not blow up my animals. You little frick. I can't believe it didn't explode. Oh my God. What am I gonna do about this? Yeah. So there is a critical bit of information that I was lacking, which is that there seems to be a feature where you can shift right click on dirt and what happens is you get pebbles this is a batania thing and it you just you just get cobblestone i don't know how you would know if you didn't just know so uh, but i'm glad that i figured it out before this went up because that was gonna be every comment like bro you idiot you just you just do this you have unlimited cobblestone at your disposal, but to that I say, I don't know. I played Batania so many times, and can I ever know that this was a feature? I'm sure there's some prior series or something like that where maybe I've utilized this, but I've done so many mud packs over the years that, yeah, so uh, we got cobblestone. Cool, we got a lot of cobblestone. Just did just a whole lot and, and as much as we could ever want from this point forward, so yep. That was painful. Didn't have to have that. Now I have a, I have a furnace. I have, oh, so many things have changed for us here. Truly in incredible. I wonder if I should make the ax though from, uh, from the silent gear thing as well. No, we do actually need to make it in order to unlock challenges, just like standard vanilla. So I'll do that, but I don't know, maybe after that expires, the next one that we'll make, we'll do out of silent gear and we'll see what that does. Cause I assume it'll have, you know, special attributes or something that we can do. Wow. That's so great. <laughs> I can break things now. You st stupid. I'm, I'm eating them. I'm getting them the frick out. Oh, wow, there's a whole bunch of information. It's almost like vault gear or something like that. That's cool. Vault gear from Vault Hunters. Sorry, if, if the reference was missed, 
Uh, but there we go. Okay. Oh, now we have so much wood. We're going to be able to make some fences. We're going to be able to put the animals into pens. Funny how nice getting cobblestone from dirt is for our quality of life. Actually, do we have vein miner here? At least not on the default key. I'll have to go and double check that, but I wouldn't be surprised if we don't since, you know, we're kind of starting from scratch here. Vein miner might make it too easy for us to spleef the entire island out from under us, which I would... Honestly, vein miner is a bit of a hazard because it will 100% accidentally break a dirt block and then the entire island will go bye-bye and everything is going to be bad. <laughs> so maybe it's better that we just, you know, don't have that or something. Okay, this is big. So we got a whole bunch of saplings and uh, we got plenty of cobble. I can make a furnace or furnaces, maybe a couple of those, just so that we can... Get things rolling there. And then we have uh, coal that I can actually mine. How exciting. Although, is there anything we want to smell? I mean, I could smelt the diamond ore, or we could just wait on it. I don't know. Let's get a little bit more iron, maybe. Okay, hey, look, this is going to be so good. I'm still not able to collect the zinc, am I? Am I? No, I'm not. Oh, oh, look. Oh, the next few. Oh, the next few were just going to be things that I'd be able to mine. But I can't. Uh... God dang it, if I had known about the cobble, I would have had two iron by now at least. Because I would have been I, I would have gotten one from here, and then I wouldn't have been able to have enough for a pickaxe yet. But I think I just I don't think there's any way around. I think I just have to break this for now, right? And then oh, Podzel. Okay, so maybe it occasionally will throw in things from prior tiers so that there we go! Stone! Yellerite! We're gonna make a freaking reactor! And then we got Yo, I do have three granite. I'm actually kind of curious just to see what it looks like if we were to make something. I, I really am gonna have to sort out my blocks, but I'll do that in between episodes so you don't have to, you know, spend a bunch of time on that for now. But if we do a pickaxe here, I'm super curious. So we go there and then we do a few of these. Granite pickaxe head. So what does it do, I wonder? I wonder if it's like any better than the stone one. Let's see, increases XP dropped by blocks and mobs. Gear occasionally takes less damage, cancels with brittle. I wonder about the mine speed on it. Like, can it break redstone? Be honest, it seems pretty bad. <laughs> it seems pretty bad. What a disappointment. <laughs> uh, I, I feel like maybe I'm missing an earlier way of getting iron, but at the same time, I don't think we can just shift right click on uh, on something and, and have it spit iron ore out, sadly. I don't think it works that way. Would be nice though. Okay, you know what? No, 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 no. We have enough wood. It is time to make pens and somehow get the animals to go in them, even if we don't have. Oh, actually, you know what? No, 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 no. We can get the sheep and the cow. We just the and probably the chicken, but the pig's gonna be a little bit of a pain in the butt. I am extremely satisfied that four pens of the same size, perfectly symmetrical, across the island. Didn't even plan it that way. And a couple of the animals were like, oh yeah, you can build the pen around me, totally. I got you. But now I need to figure out how to get the other pig into the wa- Ow! <laughs> God dang it! At least it happened to me and not one of the chickens. God dang it, what the frick? Okay, I need to get a seed. How am I gonna get a seed? Yeah, I don't think I can get a seed yet, can I? Anyway, it's fine. Uh, you? Go, 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 go over here. I do it. Get it, get it, no! Go in, what about him? You're so annoying. Go, go, yep, yep, just stay, stay there, stay there. But then the other one, but then the... I have made the decision I'm simply going to focus on the cow and the sheep and leave the others until we have the proper breeding materials. <laughs> okay, you got, you can, yep, come on over here. I'll get you both in there. Okay, perfect, beautiful, you're doing great, you're doing great, and then we will nudge. We will simply nudge y you. Get, prepare, prepare for nudge, prepare for nudge. Go, 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 yeah, 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 yo, let's go. This is a breed moment. That's a true breeding moment. Let's go. This is huge. Advancement made. That's um oh, not not one of the not one of the mod pack advancements, but six more times and we will be there. And okay, so hey, at least we've got one of every animal in a pen. It's just you guys are I guess being slightly more disagreeable, but fine, whatever. I'm going to get you in there eventually, okay? It's going to happen. Both of you. I suppose this would be a good time to get some grass spread going so that we can get some 
sheep getting their wool regrown. And I think that even without iron, I should be able to make some shears because we've got the, we have thought, never, never mind. I thought maybe we had a shear blueprints, but there probably, I think there are shear blueprints. How do I make that though? I need a blueprint paper and a stick and blueprint paper requires, huh, wait, what is this? A template though. Okay, a template, template board requires a knife plus a log and the knife, we do have a knife blueprint. All right, let me try, let me try this. So knife blueprint, was that simply this plus that gets me a knife blade. Oh, and then maybe I can just do this and then we get a knife. And then if I do that, yo, it gets me the templates. Okay, cause I would, I would like to get shears. I, I, I would do want to spend my first few iron on a pickaxe, so it could be a little ways away depending upon how long it takes for us to actually get iron in the one block. So then I can do, wait, so that, does that allow me to then make, oh, so blueprint and template, oh, it's once versus many times, but they have the same effect. Got it. So I wonder if I can do this with, um, well, first off, I guess we need to do that right there. And then I wonder if I can do it with stone. So it's like slightly better dura than the wood, probably, maybe. So we do that plus these two. Yeah, wait, shears blade. And then do I combine with a stick? Everything just combines with a stick. <laughs> okay, wait, this is sick. Okay, and we're getting grass spread. So hey, give me that, give me that. Uh, Wait, this is gonna be, oh, oh God. Really, you only gave me one? I can't even make a carpet like this. I can't work with these conditions. Oh, hey, you give me two, but I can't reach. Oh, wait, no, we got that. Uh, hold on. Oh, yeah, pass it over to me. You're not gonna pass it over to me, are you? Gosh dang it. Can I reach? Can I reach? I can't reach, can I? Okay, but I can do this. And then we can get out. The, let's see, we'll do one right there. I'll do one over there. Perfect. Perfect, there we go. Now we got functional animal pens. Big progress and more wood at our disposal. Oh, we're cranking away, dude. We are cranking away here. I was checking through quests and apparently I have achieved an iron level ax. Uh, does that, I don't know if that like stone ax counts for that. Like achieve a stone level ax and also an iron one, both by getting a stone ax. Anyway, whatever. Cutting board, how do I make one of those? Oh, that seems pretty straightforward. Literally anything that gives me iron I could use right now. A building gadget and a, and a charging station. Are, oh God, okay, well, that's not, it's not happening yet. Although it's not terribly expensive for either of these, but I, I need an iron pickaxe. I need an iron pickaxe so badly. At least I'm at, I'm at two iron now, but wait, oh, 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 oh my guy. Oh, wait, wait, we're getting, oh, we're getting stuff. Oh, we're getting stuff. Oh, I can do it. Okay, thank goodness for quests, bro. Thank goodness. Okay, we got ourselves an iron pickaxe. This is huge for us. I gotta, I gotta keep checking quests ASAP. As soon as, as soon as they are available. And, oh, now we have create stuff at our disposal. Oh, bro, let's go. Okay, finally, finally I'm not wasting when I'm mining things here. This is a, this is a true new step in the process. I should keep my iron on me though, so that we can get things going there. And also, yo, I could make some uh, torchy poos around here and just make sure, well, actually these will be really good to have for farmland, but it'll be nice to not have to worry about mobs spawning as we get further away. So that's pretty good. Underground tier, that's where it's at. So we're at 337 total blocks mined. Oh, now we're getting it. Oh, now we're getting it. Oh, now we're getting it, dude. Uh, well, that's something. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just have to allocate basically all of our wood to making, what is this, green sapphire? Yeah, I'm gonna have to make a lot of chests. Also, do we really care for these at the moment? Do we really care for these at the moment? I'm not entirely sure, but yeah, okay. Uh, chest real estate is a hot commodity around here, so I'm gonna have to figure out a place to, I don't know, put a lot of these or something like that. Hey, by the way, you guys, uh, you guys getting your, your wool back? Yeah, let's go, dude. We love grass around these parts. We love grass. Okay, perfect, perfect. We're getting more wool. And I'm probably just gonna focus on some inventory sorting, like I said, in between some episodes. Um, but you don't, you, you, this is fine. It's, see, cause I can do that. And then I, yeah, and now it becomes one. What was two becomes one. But I, it's gonna be harder to repeat, but you know what? It's great. Cause I can actually, I can just start kind of an inventory system here. And then when I wanna move it, I can move it. And we don't, we don't really have to worry. So it should be fine. No! God! No! God! No! I just want to get a diamond pickaxe. That's my goal. Diamond pickaxe. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, it's two. No! Stop this! 
rain. Don't you, don't you do this to me. Did I have any other diamonds? I just, that's my goal. That is my ultimate goal for episode one. Diamond pickaxe and we pop off and don't get blown up by creeper. No, no. You frick, my inventory was full. Oh God, everything that was on the ground. Oh God, oh geez. Oh no, ho oh, ho ho. This is pain, it's pain, it's pain. I've made mistakes. It's raining and I guess that's appropriate for what's going on right now. It's like rain on your wedding day. It's free of us that you just didn't take. Who would have known? One more diamond, one more diamond, one more diamond. Please, one more diamond. Just one more diamond. Oh my God. Wait, 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 wait. Can I? There is actually quick insert with cork. So that's going to make our lives 10 times easier. But still, please. Just... No. I actually really should move the one block from or move the animal pens from the one block. God. I'm going to back away. Just a di just one more diamond. Just one more diamond. Just one more diamond. Please, please, please. One more diamond. One more diamond. One more diamond is all I ask for. You little frick. You little frick. Oh God, how did I whiff? What am I doing? Ah! It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, it's, it's great, it's great. I do that, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, uh, I just wanna make a bed and make it not, not be this anymore. I don't wanna be here, and where's the wool? Give me your wool. Let me make a bed. Where the frick is the wool? There it is, there it is. Bed, I'm done with the rain. I just need one more diamond. Ah! Oh! How hard could it be? How hard could it be for one more diamond? They, they, oh boy. Back when it was hard to mine the diamonds. No, don't do that. Oh God, I threw everything in. I didn't want to do that. Oh, back when it was hard to find the diamonds, they were like, oh, I don't know. I'm not, I'm going to, I'm going to present you with them. I'm going to tease you with them. But now that it's tough, you don't want to give me diamonds. Well, look at all these ores that we've mined them. Please. Oh God, oh hello. It's so good to actually, I'd love to have some slime balls. And I also, yeah, I should probably make a sword, but the ax is serving us pretty well. We're getting our crit practice in. I guess I'm just gonna go until the pickaxe expires here. That's gonna happen first, diamond or pickaxe expiration. Well, everybody, we've gone through our first iron pickaxe and we're one diamond short. Being able to make the big X. Gosh dang it. All right. Well, you know what? I think that's where we're gonna leave it off for episode one. I hope you've enjoyed. Again, make sure to like. Help us get our target goal of one like for uh, the first episode of One Block. And subscribe to stay tuned for more episodes in the series. There'll be a playlist in the description if you wanna catch more. Maybe you're watching in the future and there's a lot more to jump into. That's it for now. Hopefully um, we'll get luckier next time. And also uh, I'll sort things out. And I don't know if I need to move my animals back because of creepers. Anyway, that's it. I'll see you next time.